Democratic Representative Justin Pearson has made a comeback after being expelled from the House earlier this month. Pearson, along with his fellow Democratic lawmaker Justin Jones, were expelled by Republicans over a row that had taken place with regards to gun laws. While Jones had already been sworn back in, Pearson conducted a march where he slammed the House for their unjust actions. In his speech addressing the rally, Pearson said that no amount of expulsion will let end up dampering their voices as they're working for one thing, the rights of people. Both Pearson and Jones had been flagging the issue of gun safety in the House right after the Nashville shooting incident occurred. The duo of Pearson and Jones were interim state representatives who had recently joined the legislature. Their expulsion had created a huge uproar as it was viewed to be a racist act. What is our job? It's to elevate the voices of the six kids, the six people in Nashville. Yeah. The three children who were just nine years old. Yeah. It's to elevate the five folk in Louisville yeah. who died from gun violence that was preventable. Yeah. We know it's preventable because there are good laws. That I think today the Shelby County Commission did the work of justice, which, to which was to restore the representation for District 86 back to the State House and to fight the anti-democratic behavior of the Republican majority in Tennessee. We were in step on. Come on. Yeah. We've been in this fight and we will remain in this. It is really important that we have voices of advocacy who promote justice and who fight for our communities in such a time as this. The reality is the state Republican Party and the Tennessee General Assembly tried to silence the voices of Memphis and Shelby County, County and Millington. They tried to expel the voice saying we need to do something about gun violence, we need to do something about gun control, and today that voice will be back to work tomorrow in the state capitol. We're going to keep fighting to end gun violence. We're going to keep fighting to end environmental racism and injustice. We're going to keep fighting for our community to lift up those who have been pushed to the periphery, to move them into the center of conversation and decision making. Not the gun lobbyists, not the NRA, not the billionaires and the people who are funding other folks' campaigns, but rather the people. And so when we walk in that chamber on tomorrow as representatives again, yeah. we must continue to demand that led us there in the first place. Yeah. That a week after a mass shooting hit Nashville, rather than pass common sense gun laws, they passed a resolution to expel the two youngest black members in the General Assembly. Yeah. And so we walk in there tomorrow with a clear message that we have a demand of Cameron Sexton to resign. Yeah. 